Prosecutors have charged former Atlanta police officer Garrett Rolfe with 11 counts, including felony murder, for the shooting death of 27-year-old Rayshard Brooks, who he shot twice in the back outside a Wendy's restaurant June 12th. Meanwhile, new video has emerged of Rayshard Brooks speaking in his own words about his struggles with the criminal justice system. The experience of being locked up in prison, he says, left him deep in debt and struggling to pay court fees and restitution, even as employers turned him away due to his criminal record. Brooks spoke in February with the group Reconnect. I just feel like some of the system could, you know, look at us as individuals. We do have lives, you know, we're, it's just a mistake we made, you know, and, you know, not, not just do us as if we are animals. I think it's, it's really um, sort of eerie to hear Rayshard in his own voice talk about um, not being treated like an animal. And then to see sort of these images and to, um, you know, see the video from the very beginning. I mean, in so many ways, what we're seeing with these charges is a, is a deep sort of recognition of the power of a movement, the power of a movement to push and exact consequences. But we have to recognize at the end of the day, we have to raise the floor of what's acceptable. And we also have to keep a deep vision for what human rights looks like. And I do think that, you know, in these states that have failed to prosecute police time and time again, have failed to put laws in place to hold police accountable, that instead of calling uh, a tow truck, uh, we call police, are now sort of putting things in place like the death penalty, which um, is one of the most inhumane sort of exercises of, of how we sort of uh, move towards consequences and punishment in this country. And so I think that um, all of this, right, is important in terms of getting justice for the family. And at the same time, we have to continue to keep our eye on all the ways that the system realigns itself, uh, protects itself, and really hear those uh, sort of words of Rayshard Brooks about being treated like an animal and recognize that there are so many others that are continuing to be treated like animals, enemy combatants in their own neighborhoods by police.